Hello everyone, this is Gino, and today I'm going to be playing Life is Strange. Now, I have heard nothing but good things about this game, and I saw it on the Steam, and was that Steam Exploration Sale? Well, basically Steam's Black Friday deals, and saw all the games, or not all the games, all, like the whole game, the whole game, episodes 1 through 5, was about 13 bucks, so I decided, why not? Let's let's see what this game has to offer. Let's see what makes people uh, praise it so much. So here we go. Okay. vibration. Whoa! Yo, that's crazy. Okay, I'm gonna get inside the lighthouse. Wow. Oh, oh no. Oh no, where do I go? Around here. Oh jeez. Holy shit! Yeah, that's what I said. Wow. So surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, These I'm in class. Everything's story. cool. So I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't and white? fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as I can't torture, believe right? I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people... I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Distance? She had a brilliant eye. So, she could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I should I'm take less expensive and I have to work. get my daily selfie I quota. Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. What? You could take he a captured selfie. the essence of post-war beat America. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air. But a beauty in the struggle. You, you don't shh. Sh I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. 
Oh. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh. <laughs> I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Ooh. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them Sorry, Max. No more selfies right time. now. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Huh. Wow. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. <laughs> Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. You have just by participating. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. This is just a bump on a bigger road. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this purge. Dang, that's fucked up, dude. What? Obviously, Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Oh, hey. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Thank you. Teenage angst. Teenage depression. Holy shit. <coughs> New achievement. Wait. Whoa, 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 wait, what? Ah, uh, I couldn't see what was this. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, this is her journal. Okay. Let's get down to Fable, all contraire. Now Blackwell's enemy seems more excited to me than any other place in the world. The study of photography under Mark Jefferson. Ugh. Ah! Insert heart and flowers for such a week. Oh, boys. Oh, I'm like, oh, that's so funny. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Shit is crazy here. 
crazy with the K. I'll just grab lights back inside. It's pack all my crap on down. You know, I'm gonna just freaking. It made me want to cry like a you know, BC at all. So instead of packing them for like wearing all my clothes, I'm just freaking out. Just like, not sure. Like, have an album. After. And we all know me, so we go in. Who knows? I'm just looking to cut my hair and get a tat, some piercings, maybe get a key coin exchange, or a tease from per Paris, Le Drum. Do anything and also get busted. And there'll be so many super good chances around the game. Very good. Okay, different uh, Blackwell. Yeah, she Blackwell Academy. Okay, page four. I don't really know. My shit is in boxes all over the room, which is small, but my windows. She is in. Yeah, she is in high school. Okay, just making sure. Oh, I'm starting to move. Blackwell sucks ass. Wow. Good with games like this. Like pick up some games like Kate Brook Taylor, Alyssa, and Sweet Jason. It's the torch and looks at my raggedy ass. I saw her. That would be easier being back. Call the Lambulance. I want to go straight down to all those max. Ass load of homework, so much bullshit. Let's get those snoops a day. Climb, acclimates. Snaps, Warren Graham. Serious geek, dark and witty. <coughs> Good start, Graham. I thought being 18 meant you. Oh, she is 18. Wait, so. She's in college, right? I think. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> October, the best weather of the year. Jazz Victoria Chase. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. 
Well, now is the time to speak. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. But I still dig my little instant camera. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Get the fuck out of here. I was about to. You Welcome to the real world. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. I'm not paying $150 for it. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. What's the fun? She plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant shark. <laughs> Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. I hate having everybody see inside my locker. What is inside your locker? I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous, as usual. Driving a car by the seaside, watching the Yes, this poster must stop boys dead in their tracks. That's Dana talking to I think his name is Justin. Dana is on my floor too. She's such an archetypal gorgeous cheerleader. Whoa. They must make them in a factory. Bitch. I shouldn't be so catty. Dana is nice to me. Stella is always deep in her notes. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. Oh, what the fuck? Poor Dan, he's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. I hate Bully Jock straps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. I wish October would last forever. It looks like she's been gone for months. They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. 
Don't be the PC. You missed the poetry jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. Talking about her own place, That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. No one can As if I am. Till she got tired to come play. Good thing I left my AK at home. Oh, damn. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. There's Juliet from my dorm. Yet another Vortex Club disciple. He's cute. I like skater boys. Too bad they don't like me. God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kind of like that about him. Blackwell sure takes its swimming seriously. But otters are cute. Go otters. Look at these trophies. Gotta give it up for those Bigfoots. They do stomp. I find it kind of weird that when you just look, you're just standing right in front of them and then they don't notice shit. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Nerd alert. This poster has Warren written all over it. To all of you. American girls, it's Principal doesn't come out of his office much. Miss Grant is a great science teacher. American girls, I'd like to be part of There's the lighthouse again. <coughs> Driving a car by the seaside. Right, time to go Watching finally the to the from the bright side. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. <sighs> the last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. No. <laughs> Tampon. I'm good to flow, thanks. This poster must drive people to have sex. Wait, Illuminati? <sighs> I hate Victoria Chase. I remember when somebody punked the alarm last month. At least I got out of science class for that quiz. Now who would bother to write that crap? Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Whoa, what the hell? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. 
Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Holy shit. Holy shit, dude. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, oh, shit. Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer? I cannot believe who this. Capture the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? What? Because of her images of hopeless faces. What the fuck, I feel like dude? totally haunted by Holy shit. I did now, it. Can you I actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human the human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, Max. Faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and When children. I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Tortured, right? If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. As you all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again Bulgarian process and give him the right answer? Out detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. Now, Max, Whoa. since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits the daguerrean process invented by a french painter named louise daguerre around 1830 somebody has been reading as well as posing nice work max <sighs> the daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. 
You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Damn, dude. Holy shit. Shit is real. Holy fuck. God damn. Holy fuck. Okay. I'll take a break right here. I'll be right back.